What's going on guys welcome back to another video so in today's video we're going to be talking about did Fortnite fix the meta because recently they made a bunch of changes we're going to talk about the changes they made and talk about if it's going to fix the stupid SMG meta that really nobody likes so let's get into it guys. So the first change that Epic made that I want to talk about is the change to mats and building. So basically they increased Wood's HP by 10, they increased Stone's HP by 20, and they increased Metal's HP by 30. So basically what they did there is make it so it's harder to shoot down the walls, so you're not going to see so many people uh, praying and spraying, and it's going to change the meta. Well hopefully it does. You know, it's not guaranteed, but I think this is a step in the right direction, so let's see how it goes. Alright, so next is the big changes that happened the changes to two weapons in particular that were everybody was complaining about i'm going to put a couple clips in right now of a big youtubers and uh, streamers talking about it trust me man. i have never taken three hours to get a win in my life you know, you know it, 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 that's just gotta say something about the meta dude like listen dude they need to remove the p90 remove the, the tommy gun and then buff the shotties a little bit and then fortnite will be good again those 50 magazine no man that's what's crazy about the p90 it's just such a long magazine what do you think about the current state of fortnite it's fucking stale what kind of changes do you think need to be made they need to give you another option besides using an smg like honestly it's just bring back double shotty if they leave shotties how they are relatively just bring back double shotty bump i mean shotgun smg is still gonna be better but at least you'll have some fucking variety you know what i'm saying all right so after all that backlash epic finally made some changes here's what they did to the compact smg p90 what they did was they reduced damage by one point which isn't that much it went from 22 to 21 and for after uh, the purple 21 to 20. they reduced the magazine size from 50 bullets to 40. so that's a really really big change right there that means plus with the walls being stronger it's going to be a lot harder for people to get through people's walls just by spraying that gold p90 it's amazing. I'm happy they did that. It's a really good change. They did nothing wrong this update in my eyes. Alright, so the next changes they made is to the drum gun. And what they did with the drum gun is they reduced the fall off, first of all, which is really good. It means your bullets aren't going to travel as far as they used to. And they reduced it by 10% on the green and the blue. Next, what they did was they decreased jumping accuracy. What does that mean? That means you can't jump and shoot your gun. Well, you could, but it's 5% less accurate, which is really important. Next, after that, and... I would say most important is they decrease targeting accuracy, which is basically bloom. What that means is when you shoot at somebody, you're, there's only a certain um, percentage of bullets that are guaranteed to hit. Now it's 10% less accurate, so you're not going to be hitting as many bullets uh, on first shot accuracy and stuff like that. So that's really, really important. That's going to make a huge change uh, when it comes to using the drum gun. And finally, they reduce the spawn rate from chests and floor loot um, by 40%. That means we're going to see 40% less drum guns. It's a good gun. I love the gun, but I think there's too many of them floating around in circulation. At the end of the game, everyone has that gun. Everyone's using it in their loadout, and it's just OP. Everyone's loadout consists of a drum gun, a P90, a shotgun, and some meds, or an RPG, a sniper, and some meds. So honestly, this is going to make a big difference to the game. This is going to change the meta drastically. Is it going to be the perfect meta? No, I don't think so. I don't think we're there yet. I still think we need a buff um, in shotguns or bring back uh, double pump but either way it's a it's a step in the right direction so thanks for doing that epic and guys that's gonna wrap up this video thanks for watching please leave a like comment subscribe if you guys enjoyed it and i'll catch you guys in the next one